Hey everybody, it's PC here, and welcome to another episode of Void Train. And yes, we have now actually have a proper train. Uh, we haven't used it yet, uh, probably won't be using any fuel it. I do know with the, the, the steam engine, we don't actually need to use wa water and coal to to move. Uh, it's just if we want to actually accelerate, that we do. Oh yeah, hit the steam whistle there, but yeah, that's basically what this is. Like, uh, right now, if we go we'll go at a slow speed and we'll basically use no fuel but if we want to go to a medium or a faster speed or even use the afterburner and i honestly don't even want to know why we would need to move fast but i'm sure we'll find out sooner or later uh that's why we have this now the fuel we can use any type of fuel that we can make sturdy boards i don't know where we get those from yet uh i think might be able to make them with the workstation i have to look uh sterile sterilizer fat and then of course uh, the coals too now the coal briquette we can actually make in the the crusher over there now it also does need water now if the water i could put ice or i could also put the water bidden in there and the water bidden is just a higher amount of water i think i can't remember if i actually put something in there but i have gone ahead and uh, not only crafted uh, crushed some ice and some coal to free up some space i have organized the things a little bit more made a few more shelves i do now have a a chest for everything. I got wood here, scrap iron here, chemicals here, uh, fat here, and I roughly have an idea where everything is. Uh, the back four here are going to be for gun parts and ammo and stuff like that. And then over here, going to be steel, copper, and different components and stuff like that. And then other miscellaneous stuff. Now, another one I was doing too is I was looking at the the armory, and I decided to take all the gun parts that I had and come up to the armory and see what I could I could actually create. And these are the only parts I could uh, actually assemble, these these three. And this is the type of weapon it gives me. Now, the fire rate seems a lot higher than old, uh, old, the old Prospect, that's what it was called. But it has uh, different things here, too, like while reloading if damage is taken. Uh, there's a 19% chance of stealing, what, stealing ammo? I have no idea what that means. Uh, accurate increase, accuracy increases while firing, and each five shots deals increased damage. So, these are special traits that come with this gun that I have created. Now, I don't don't know how it compares to the other one, uh, but let's go ahead and actually grab one piece of scrap and craft this thing and check it out. Uh, this is also what I'm going to need uh, the special ammo here down here for. Now, uh, the ammo box, if I consume it, will fill up. The equivalent of whatever weapon I'm currently using. So if I create this and use it, let's say, uh, rifle ammo, for instance, then it'll give me 50 rounds. If it's a shotgun, it gives me 20 shotgun rounds, depending on which one I actually have equipped. And I went over here for scrap. That's, that's right. So we'll take that out. And I'll also put all this other stuff. Actually, no, I want to see if I can change them out afterwards. I've never actually done much of this part. All right, so what do I do? All right. Oh. Okay, what do I do here? Uh, what am I doing here? I have no idea. Uh, let me figure this out. Okay, I think I figured it out, and I'm sure some of you already know what's going on. I actually do need the other three parts, so I can't do anything with this yet. So that's fine. Uh, I have looked at swapping out these parts for the old prospect here, and not, not one of them, not much, any, none of them actually do much to help. So uh, just put all this stuff away, and we will head off into the new void. All right. Um, what else do I have on me? I can put that stuff away. Uh, let's see. Scrap goes in here. Wood goes in here. I want an empty inventory. I do also want to grab the stuff I had in here. Some food and plating. Not that I need the plating, but just in case. Because you never know what's going to be out there. Alright. Let's roll. Alright. Fill the engine with ice. Ooh. Uh, this is an interesting world. Alright, let's pull that brake. Nice squeal. Alright, so we gotta fill the engine with ice now. Oh. 
No, no, don't use the afterburner. I was wondering what the handle did. So that's transmission. And that's a break. Okay. So I gotta put ice in here. Do I have any ice on me? No, I don't. Well, let's do what it says. I have crushed some ice. Actually, I made the bit in. Uh, where did I put that ice? Uh, hmm. There it is. Alright. I think this is about as far. I don't think I've actually used this much. Oh, come on. Let's put all 10 in there. Okay. And fill the engine with any fuel. That's fuel. Okay. And we do that. And we put two coal in there. And activ activate acceleration. In other words, afterburner. 200% fuel. I have absolutely no, fu no idea how fast this is going to go. Definitely cruising. Wow. Oh. Okay, I don't want to go too fast now. Uh, for one, we're going to burn that fuel pretty quick. Oh. Wait for you to come back. Anyway, uh, let me deal with this guy and uh, get my bearings, and I'll bring you right back. Okay, we're coming up to another outpost up here. Uh, what's been dealing with this? This oversized guppy. He's been coming around quite often, and I think I might actually be able to take him down. I just get a few headshots in him, but uh, it's like I move a couple of feet and he starts coming. I don't want to have him around when I'm dealing with these guys over there. Now, where are you? Come on. Oh, there you are. Where are you? I heard you. You're around. There you are. Alright. Well, I'm gonna take care of him. And then I'll bring you back and we'll take care of outpost. This is where I want to get a better gun. Oh, I might actually be able to get him down here. Okay, I'll bring it back when he's done. Alright, I got him. Uh, that's one of the things that I'm going to have to install when we get back to the next depot is... Drop some leather. Uh, so I want to install that manual handle again because I can't shoot this thing. I'm probably going to blow up my boiler if I do. So let's just roll ahead and see what he dropped. I think it's just a little bit of fat and a little bit of uh, a little bit of leather. That's one thing I like about having a long train is you know you got so much ground to cover you can stop in one spot and pick everything up right as you go. I got it. No, I That's all I really care about is the leather. I get the fat from these little guys all the time, and I will have to excuse me on that. Grab that wood. Okay, um, let's go ahead and have a bit of a snack. I'm going to grab a little bit more food, which I have already cooked. Alright, let's roll. Now the question is, do we ram it? Hmm. No, we don't ram it. I've just got the basic stuff here. What am I going to do, though? Is I'm going to stop the train now and see if we can take these guys out. See if we can like, get up on top of the engine or something. Get a better vantage point. Right up on the smokestack. Or on the front of the light. Alright, where are you? We got a lot of armor. I need a better gun. That's a nice shot. 
I'm still standing there. I can see a gun. Missed him. That's ah, cheese in it. I know. I figured they'd come out one by one. I see you. I so I knew uh, animation was taking up the shark too. Uh, the, uh, what was it? The barrel, the uh, chamber fell out. He hits it with, pulls out a hammer and hits it with it. That's pretty funny. There's a grenade launcher when you need it. Terrible shot, I know. Uh, it's just telling me to move forward. It doesn't say how many I've taken out yet. I don't think it does anymore. Oh, they've tracked on me, have they? Just about a scratch. Where are you guys hiding? I don't think I killed you already. Uh, maybe, no. Could have been that easy. Move forward a little bit. Okay, who's still here? I see you. Even get you from up here. No. All right. Well, let's just roll forward and finish him off. Uh, let's go ahead and eat up. All right. Go. Do it. Got the engine to hide behind. And I'll we'll stop right there. Hey, where are you? I have a feeling this is the only guy that's left to... You know what, let's just go in. We'll tank it. Come out, come out. Oh my god, we went right through it. Ha ha ha. That's hilarious. I want to stop this. Come on, stop. I actually want to go to the best explore this area. Come on, where'd they go? Where are you? I see you. New armor on, and who's left? Nice. Oh, not now. Come on. Alright, that should be it. Oh, 
Star Shadow. Music too. I guess we're good. Alright, I guess we'll deal with the battery since we're here. I can't remember if there's actually something I was supposed to do with this or just yank the thing out. And you can turn the lights off. I don't know if there's a, like an Easter egg if you turn all the lights off as you go, if something happens down the road. I have no idea. Okay. Not that I need to do that because we broke through the barricade anyways. Uh, I got some loot there. I just didn't drop it down to the bathroom, but oh well. Alright, let's see what we got here. Uh, I don't have any, don't have room for the ammo. Uh, what do you got? Come on. Put all this stuff up. Maybe I can actually build a... Something better than this. Shooting a revolver. Okay. Well, let me look around and I'll bring you back when we're ready to go. Okay, we are on our way. I didn't really find too much. I did find some more, like, random grips and stuff like that to replace with this. Um... Can't really do too much with that until I find more parts because clearly that's what's going on. You need a scope and all that stuff. But anyways, it's time to move forward. So I'm gonna move forward. I'm gonna collect some stuff and I should be finding zinc or something soon, really, I think. Oh, actually, that's what we're gonna do. Maybe we'll do that right now. I mm, love that screech. Uh, let's see what I got for scrap. Is I was looking what I need, and I need six iron and two copper to research the smelter too. And I'll probably start unlocking the zinc and all that stuff. So I need two iron ingots, two bolts, two gears, and two pipes. I do have copper, but let me get all that stuff ready and I'll bring you back and maybe we'll run into some adventures along the way. Okay, just making up the gears now, this last of the parts, and then uh there's something I actually forgot about, and it's a good thing I was checking because I would have run, run right into it and not even realized it. Alright, so let's go here and we'll go ahead and research this smelter too. And then of course we're going to be rebuilding it. So let's see what this actually costs. We can actually bring up the right button. Smelter 2. A lot of iron, a lot of copper, of course. Anyway, uh, situation at hand are these things. Bad news. Now there's a piece of scrap metal trying to kill us too. Yep. Minefields coming to different times. Uh, Demining. Now, what do they mean by demining? Like actually destroying them? Can I actually get scrapped by doing this? Or do I have to actually fly up to it? Well, let's find out. I don't think I've actually read that before, but if I can get free scrap out of these things, worth it, I guess. Where'd that piece go? There it is. Alright. I think I'm going to install a handle at the front of this thing. Now, i got to be careful because he said that these could be mag magnetized. I don't know if, A, if I can reach it. I guess it's just going to be a little bit of target practice. Not like I'm paying for the ammo anyways. Oh yeah, the uh, chain. Anyway, uh, I'll bring you back when I'm through this this minefield. Ooh, piece of coal. Okay, so while I was out here and gathering resources, I had a thought. There's a reason why I'm not finding uh, zinc. Because I have to unlock the extraction for it. So I need three copper wire and three whatever that thing is. 
So let's actually get that going. I actually do have a whole bunch of copper made and uh, um, iron. Yeah, that's what that was the word I was looking for. Uh, having crafts and stuff as I go offline, or as I've been going, I should say. Um, what I need though is what was that compound? Resin. Oh. All right. Well, let's do that. Uh, that's the wrong chest. Pick up some chemicals. We'll make a three resin. One, one, two, three. And then we go over here. We'll make three wire. All right. Because I have a feeling that we're going to be unlocking the gravel pretty soon. I actually want to do that because soon we start to get get off this train and do some exploring. My God, the amount of fuel I. The amount of wood that I go through with fuel is just unbelievable. I probably should be using fat, but it's not really useful that well. Well, I won't say useful. It doesn't really last too long. And I don't want to use the coal because we need the coal for the, the trains. And you know how it is. Right? And there we go. Okay, so that's going to research this. Even though I'm jumping the gun on the quest line there, but whatever. And I actually need zinc for this. Now, I don't think we're going to get zinc until the next next void. Or the next path, as they're calling it. But anyway, uh, that, that was a thought I had. Uh, we should be getting close to the gate pretty soon. It seems like I've been going at a pretty, a pretty fast rate. It's kind of hard to tell how fast we're really going because the train is actually getting bigger, so it's kind of hard to tell. Even at this speed, it seems like it's going pretty fast. But anyways, I will do some more gathering and I'll bring you back when we're at the next destination. Okay, uh, I've been at this for a little while now and it didn't even occur to me that uh, the zinc is actually spawning. There's actually a chunk up ahead that we're going to go check out. Uh, I have been gathering a whole bunch of stuff, a lot of scrap, a lot of wood. I have a whole bunch of iron pre-made, ready to go. In fact, I'll get another batch up as soon as I get more fuel in there. Put another 10 sticks in, I'll take that, put that in here with that, and as you can see, I got two zinc already. There is one more zinc at the top here, we'll check this out, and then uh, go ahead and research that. Uh, that is for brass. I think the brass is what we need the advanced smelter for. Uh, that's our leech. And, uh, yeah, and then we, I believe it's copper and zinc will make us uh, the brass. No, I know where it is. It's actually just above me, but, you know, we need everything. But there it is. There's the zinc. Okay, we we'll grab that, and now let's go see what we need to research this. Oh, it's so handy having this long train. You know, you don't have to worry about missing something because <laughs> the train's got some length to it already and I can only imagine eventually the train's going to reach all the way to that stopper back there. Okay, uh, what was I doing? Research, research, research. Okay, research. I need three copper. I have the copper right in here. Not as much as I'd like, so let's go ahead and... Queue up some copper. Oh, that's not what I want to do. We're going to need copper anyways. Okay. I like so. And this will give us uh, brass casting. And now, hopefully... No. Oh. Oh. I wonder if I can upgrade the stuff I already have. And brass pipes, brass this, brass that, and workbench too. Uh, hang on, let's start. I'm sorry about that. Spontaneous yawn. Alright, so, uh, yeah, so we do have to make the second smelter, so let's go ahead and do that when this is done. Uh, probably keep chugging along here and see what else we can get. Uh, if, I'm assuming we're going to be getting to the gate pretty quick here. I've been going at it for quite some time. At least it feels like it anyways. I might miss some zinc back there. You know what? Let's go grab it. If I don't grab it, it'll be one of those situations. I'll be in a situation where I'll be like, oh man, I wish I grabbed that last piece of zinc that I saw. Probably not, but you never know. Right? Alright. Got 
much be digging in a moment. And if I had a lot of scrap, so it's been pretty good. Again, nothing too serious. No more mines, no more. I haven't seen the Shark Boy in a while. I think, uh, like a one one spawn per world kind of deal. Once I take once I take it out, that just doesn't come back anymore. So maybe when I got rid of it the f first time, when I got it down to a single hit, uh, maybe he ran into something, ate one of the flying guys and choked on it, and that's all I needed. Just basically a, a, a sneeze and he was done. Oh. Uh, oh, yeah, we were researching something, weren't we? Or we were building something. And let's actually stop that for now. What were they doing here? Uh, okay, whatever. Uh, cancel you. Alright, so now what do I need for the smelter? Two. I need two bolts and two sprockets. And two wire, two pipe. Okay, let me get that and I'll be right back. Okay, almost done. And I don't know why I keep calling them sprockets. I really should be calling them cogs. Anyway, uh, I'm assuming that this thing actually replaces this. Now, how big is it? Is it considerably bigger? Oh, and you have four pipe and two more bolt, two bolts. Okay. There we go. So now let's see, actually see how big this thing is. Oh, that's a big one. Hmm. Do I want to keep it there then? It'll be in the in the way no matter what I do. Sure. All right. Well, let's exit out of here, and then let's dismantle this thing. All right. Deconstruct. Okay. Now go back into build mode, and let's get that smelter up. Oh wow, it's gonna be, leave me like no room to walk around here. We're gonna need another wagon. Possibly, I could probably rearrange the storage, but that's fine. Alright, now let's check this thing out. So. Okay, so I do need both of them. Hmm. Kind of a. Kind of a bummer. Oh, I guess we're gonna have to move this. Yeah, we're definitely gonna have to build another car here. Eventually. Or at least expand this one. We got the resources, so we could probably put two more platforms on here. And, uh... Yeah, I'll have to move you, I guess. Yeah, yeah relocate. There we go. Hmm. See, I want to leave that as access. In case they ever need to get to the train. So we'll just put it there for now. Okay. Now, let's build the other smelter. Or I should say, rebuild it. It'd be nice if it was a snap to grid option. There might be, I'm just not paying attention to it. Okay. There we go. So now let's move forward. What was next in the research again? Oh yeah, that's all, all this stuff. So we're not gonna worry about that. Let's just move on, move forward, and I'll bring you bring you back at the next depot. Yes, by the epic music, we are here. Uh, so actually, one thing I I do like is, you know, having this music cue in after you spend. Uh, spend uh, like a, an hour just off in the void, you know, doing little resource gathering and stuff like that. And it's quiet, soft music that they got going on, and bring on this, and it just sets the atmosphere. It's like, okay, time to get busy. And uh, hoping we're not too bad today. All right, well, let's see what we have going on. Actually, what I was gonna do? Let's, don't go in yet. Don't go in yet. Don't go in yet. Let's stop. Yeah, they want to actually research some stuff before we go in. I actually wanted to... Did I want to research anything? I don't think I did. I wanted to actually look at the container too. You know what? Let's actually do that. Let's uh, 
Two iron, two bolts, and two wood. Alright, let me figure that out and I'll check it out and then I'll go in. Okay, I should have enough. I crafted some extras too, so we can actually craft one. Maybe it'll allow me to upgrade, but I don't think that's how it works. Alright, now let's, let's actually see what this needs. I should have enough, and how big is it? Ah, oh, it's the same size. Okay, uh... Let's get out of here. Can I actually upgrade? That's the real question. Uh, no, there is no... No upgrade. Okay, um... Which one was empty? That's not what I wanted. I think this one was empty? No. That one was not empty. And that one was not empty. Uh, no. Alright, well, let's take the springs out of here. We'll throw them in there for now. And we'll bring out the hammer. And then we'll deconstruct this. Alright, and then... I just want to see how big it is. Uh, I'm forgetting my buttons already. There we go. I guess it would help if I built the right one, huh? Alright, deconstruct. Okay. Now, let's go back into the building menu. A container 2, yes. Alright. Two extra slots. <laughs> sure. Let's go. Let's do this. I could hit the afterburner, but whatever. Oh, 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 oh. Need that scrap. Need that scrap. Maybe the chemicals, too. That's not chemicals. Zinc. I have enough zinc. For now, anyways. Probably, will, probably need a lot more when time comes. Alright, let's get right on the headlight here if we can. Oh, you won't let me. I like my shadow. Plugged by the light. I wonder if we can actually go up here, maybe. Perfect. Then I get shot off from top from on top here. As you know, we're gonna have company again. Definitely, never not a perspective I've seen of you before. Whatever you are. Never did figure that out. Alright, well, um, where are they? Well, the same place as always. Okay, well, I'm gonna go take care of these guys and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, wasn't exactly super easy. Um, I had to run back to the train to make some bandages and uh, make some more armor plating. But I am back. I survived. Uh, I thought I had them all taken care of, and then there was this one guy, I don't know if he dropped anything, but he had, he had like a automatic shotgun or something like that, came around the corner blasting like eight or ten shells at a time, it's like just peppering me. But I survived, and we have a whole bunch of loot to grab, maybe you can actually make a proper weapon this time. Alright, let's look around, see what we can find. Uh, I guess I'll bring you back if I find anything good. Maybe we'll check out what mods we got or parts or what have you. So let me look around and I'll be right back. Okay, well I haven't found too much. I picked up some mods, but I thought I just had to uh, give a couple of spins on the machine here. And I picked something up. Um, what is that kind of a module? Is that? What is the blue one? A frame. Hmm. So let's go see what we can do with our... A workbench here. Yeah, sorry, had to make sure I was recording. Uh, as far as everything else goes, I didn't really find too much. Just the usual stuff. And no, I can't put a barrel or a stock on here. I don't have one. That is fine, but uh, yeah, what else can we do here? Because I want to try to get to the grapple, so maybe we'll start working on this. Um. Uh, Judging by the recording time, let me actually check and see how far we are, and maybe we'll move it in this, do this in the next one. I think we have a few minutes, I think we can actually squeeze this in. Alright, so what do we gotta do first? Uh, we do gotta make a couple of, oh, we gotta do the workbench too, which I need two zinc, what was that, two steel and two brass. 
All right, so now we're gonna actually use this thing. So let's see here, two steel. It's just one iron. Okay, that's actually not bad. And this is copper and zinc. All right, so what did I? What did I, What do we need again? Right, I'll make everything I need. Two and two, and four, and six. So I got my six brass and two steel. All right, let me do that. Learned something interesting. I didn't even notice this at first. Can't use wood in here. You have to use coal. Let me go ahead and make coal. I think I can, I can use a makeshift charcoal if I really wanted to. Let's go ahead and do that. And then uh, do two steel. And then let's see how long that's going to take. 40 seconds. Oh my god, that sounds expensive. Anyway, I have two more tokens. Let's go back to the slot machine. Back over in this room here. I was going to look at expanding the platform too. Let's see what else we can get. Oh, hey, is that actually a scope? A frame. Oh. Wow, give me something I actually need. I said something I need. Of course. Uh, of course. I don't think this frame actually does anything, does it? They already have a frame, yeah, I need a stock, a sight, and a barrel. So I don't have that stuff, and I'm running out of space to put all this, this stuff. Alright, so that, and now we do make six zinc, or brass. Takes two minutes. Alright, let me figure out what I'm going to do with my inventory space. I might actually start getting rid of some of these things, because... Oh, okay, I think I see what's going on here. Or maybe, I don't know. I have a feeling these ones here that have the multiple numbers might be the ones that I create with, and the ones that have just singles might be replacements. I think. I'm not too familiar on the whole armory aspect of it, but... You know, let's actually see what happens when we change that frame around. Uh, and you're out of fuel. Of course you are. Yeah. Let's see what happens when I change that frame. There we go. So if I change the frame to this. Oh, wow. Accuracy, fire rate, damage goes up, everything. Okay, so that is going to be that one, that section. Uh, I don't think a new grip makes any difference to me. Alright, and mag is the same one. Piece of tape pulling together. That's cool. But yeah, that's why I can't build this. Because I have to finish this, I, I'm guessing. DPS 105, 101 per sec. DPS is 101, but it's not telling me what it is on this one. It just gives me question marks. So it makes me wonder. Ugh. I'll be right back. Okay, that should be everything. I have the, the brass all made, I have the um, copper wire and the copper pipes. So now let's go ahead and we'll... I need two more bolts for that, hang on. Okay, now I should have everything. All right, grab those bolts, go over here, research this. I'm not gonna build it, just gonna research it. Okay, then we'll go ahead and we'll research this. Brass wire. And then, uh, let me guess, was it brass pipe? Brass pipe. What do you know? Now, what's next? Oh. Ammunition upgrades. Steam engine upgrade. Boiler upgrade. Oh, man, where's my grapple? All right, well, I think this would be a good place to call it. Uh, did we get some research done? We uh, did a little bit of organizing here. We got some new parts for the gun, and... That's about it. Actually, I was going to look at the platform upgrade before we leave here. See what it's going to take to expand the platform a little bit more, because, yeah, we're uh, running out of resources. Or, not resources, running out of space. We're also running out of resources, too. Uh, yeah, we might have to wait on that, I think. What is that? Oh, wow, uh, that's actually what I wanted to do. Go over here. I want to put my brake back on the front. Uh, 
Hmm, should I have one on both ends? One on both sides? They can't put it in the middle. Let's do that. And... It might also... Uh, come on. It might also be handy to have one back here, too. But I think that'll be good. Okay, so let's uh, get out of here. Oh, that's not what I want to do. Now, one thing I want to do is... Um, I can figure out how to get there. This was damaged. I don't know how to repair that. If I go over it, it's 50%. Oh, now it'll let me do it. Oh, I guess it doesn't let me repair when I'm on the road. All right, there we go. Now that was from going through that one bad, that one uh, barricade. It took off 50%. But anyways, uh, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave me a like. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Later.